Hey yo, what is up Thrill Seekers? Today I am back here, Six Flags Fiesta, Texas, for another Dr. Diabolical's cliffhanger construction update. It's done, dude. <laughs> um, they have, as of this past week, they have completely completed Dr. Diabolical's cliffhanger. This thing looks amazing. That extreme airtime hill is massive. Um, if you guys have ridden Roadrunner, uh, you know that like the windows in the station are kind of up above everyone, so you can't really see much out of them. You can still see the top of this hill, just of how high it is. It is literally higher than Roadrunner Station, which is kind of crazy. Um, that airtime hill is going to be insane. Just overall, this entire ride looks amazing. I am so insanely excited for this thing. Um, plus, I'm excited to watch them as they continue to put more of the electrical components in. Um, they still have a couple of these catwalks and stuff to put in. Um, in addition, they are going to have to put all of the proximity sensors, start to get the trains up on here um, before they can start testing. But this whole thing just looks amazing. I am so, so excited for this ride. Excited to ride it, excited to see it test. Um, just excited for, I, I hope that I'm able to operate it. Uh, that, that would be like a dream come true 100%, but man, this thing looks awesome. So what is next? Um, all they have to do now is they have to continue wiring all of the electrical components. There are so many sensors and cameras and all of that kind of stuff that go into this ride before you can start testing. Um, I think the last thing that'll probably go in is going to be those cameras uh, that I just mentioned. Um, most likely first, they're going to start putting in those proximity sensors, uh, make sure that the lift motors um, are all good. Um, the one kind of at the bottom of the lift and the one for the hold chain over there. Um, in addition, they're going to start programming the ride. Um, they have to program it so that it can run three trains. Um, basically what that means is they have to tell the system that, hey, if it gets to the top of the lift, sent like if they, it gets to the sensor at the top of the lift and the train on the course has not made it past that mid-course brake run, top of the lift will stop, right? Um, similar, uh, same thing as if, if uh, there's a train right here on this section of brake run, and there's also a train approaching uh, the mid-course brake run, then those mid-course brake run brakes should close and not let that train pass, right? That's all of the programming that goes into the ride. Um, it's a whole bunch of lines of code, basically, that make uh, all of the safety systems on every single ride run. Um, Anything from, you know, dropping that floor out whenever you press dispatch to cutting the power whenever we press e-stop to advancing the trains as one train leaves the station and, um, you know, bumping up the lift speed as soon as the train leaves the station. All of that kind of stuff is all the code that they actually have to um, write for the ride. Um, and that'll probably take a while. Um, all of the proximity sensors and the cameras and all of that kind of stuff. That'll probably take a while. So right now, you know, we just had a kind of a slow period um, with land clearing. Then we just had a super, super fast period with um, constructing this thing because the track pieces themselves are basically just like Lego pieces. You just plop them in. Um, and then we're going to hit another little slow period for a bit as they wire all of the electrical stuff. I'll still try my best to update you guys because I'm a big nerd and I do actually really want to see that electrical stuff being put in. Um, so I'll, I'll continue to update you guys on that. Um, and then after that, we should see testing. And then first riders are going to be during Roller Coaster Rodeo on June 9th. Um, they have already announced that those are going to be the first members of the public that are going to be able to ride this thing. Um, so if you really want to ride this, definitely go uh, on the Six Flags Fiesta Texas website and look up Roller Coaster Rodeo. Um, it's an awesome event, three day event, and it's super fun. Um, and you will be able to be the first riders here on Dr. Diabolical's Cliffhanger. But overall, super exciting time. The entire track structure is done, so. 
yeah super super awesome anyways that's really gonna be it for this construction update um i wanted to get this angle since we can really see the entire ride from it and especially um this last piece of track here but anyways hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to like make sure to subscribe for more of these construction updates continuing to come every single week and i'll see you guys all next time peace out huh.